You really wanted a piece of me, huh? Can we get our first 40 here? So uh, what's up guys? It's here here by Nino Kwaji and welcome back to another video of Call of Duty Warzone MW3. In today's video, we're going to be rocking and rolling with an AR that is completely dominating the SMG meta as of the latest update and that's going to be the BP-50 AR. Now in case you guys are unaware, there was a new conversion kit added to the BP-50 that you can unlock within the weekly challenges known as the Jack Revenger kit and it turns the BP-50 AR into a full-on SMG. And if you look at the tiny kill stats on true game data here compared to the HRM9 and the MCW with the conversion kit, uh, it has a better tiny kill than those two weapons when you factor in ADS time which is kind of crazy to think about because this is an AR with an SMG conversion kit. This gun has a killer tiny kill and can kill faster than both of those weapons. The only drawback of this weapon is that if you hit like lower chest and like legs and stuff, then it ha does have a dramatically slower tiny kill. So as long as you can hit upper chest, you're going to be absolutely annihilating your opponents even faster than the HRM9 and the MCW. So of course today, I went in with my BP-50 and an HRM9 double SMG combo wombo sort of loadout and I was able to drop my highest kills on Rebirth so far, which I'm not going to spoil for you guys right now. You guys got to watch till the end for that. Uh, but this BP-50 conversion with my loadout is incredible. So if you guys are excited to see this gameplay in action and see the class for yourselves, make sure to drop a like in the video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. If you're new to the channel, I upload high kill Warzone gameplays, uh, you know, with 20 bombs, 30 bombs, and maybe even the occasional 40 bomb. And I just try to have funny moments and a great time and show you guys great classes so you guys can enjoy yourselves on Warzone to the fullest. And I also upload store bundle videos and other sorts of random videos here on the channel. So hope you guys enjoy. But that's not me yapping. Let's get to the rest of the loadout here. On my perk package, I'm running Slide of Hand, Mountaineer, Tempered, and Flex. We got the lethal throwing knife to kind of finish off our foes so when we, you know, down them. Got the tactile and stim shot for a little speed boost and a health boost whenever needed. And the SMG that I'm using is the HRM9. Even though I'm running two SMGs, the BP-50 still uses AR ammo. So I'm just like, I'm also just keep myself to close situations. So when I run out of ammo with the BP-50, I use the HRM9. And if you want to, you want to see my class for that, I put that in the previous video. But without further ado, let's go ahead and show you guys the new conversion kit, BP-50 loadout meta so of course before anything else we got to put on the jack revenger kits in the aftermarket parts section or the conversion kit section of the gunsmith and this will transform this gun into an smg allowing it to have a faster fire rate and thus have a faster tiny kill better than the mcw and the hrm9 and when it comes to the rest of the attachments we got the muzzle the shot strike suppressor keeping us off the main map every time we shoot and giving us no drawbacks so that we can stay silent and surprise our opponents. The laser that I liked using was the 1MW Quickfire laser, just because the laser doesn't show up at all, uh, even when you ADS. And we get a nice little speed boost of 5%. But if you feel like there's too minuscule and you want a good laser, you can either go with the Kimura Rhine uh, laser light, which is going to give you a ton of sprint to fire time and ADS speed, so you can really be snappy with this gun. Or if you want a less, more prevalent laser, you could also use the VLK LZR MW which is still gonna show off your laser, but just a little bit less apparent. And it still gives you a considerable boost as well. So up to you on the laser, I just use the quick fire laser. The ammunition here that we're gonna use is the nine millimeter high grain rounds. Since we can't put a, a barrel or an underbarrel or anything like that, we gotta boost this gun's damage and make it melt even faster at farther ranges. And that's what these high grain rounds are gonna do, making our effectiveness 15% more effective. And lastly, for our rear grip, we're gonna be using the CCG TAC tape for sprint to fire speed and tax stand spread. This allows us to bring up the gun faster and thus give us a faster time to kill by around 13%, which is pretty considerable. But there you guys go. That is how I'm rocking the BP-50 conversion kit within Warzone. Uh, like I said, this thing is freaking demonic. I was very surprised at how amazing it is. I think I'll still stick to the HRM9 just because, like I said, this gun is kind of unforgiving if you hit the legs and the the, the the bottom chest because people be jump shotting a lot so some of your bullets might go there so the hrm9 is a little bit better but they ever nerfed the hrm9 i mean this fool might be back in line 
and uh, might be better than the HRM9. So definitely try it out. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section below. You know, combo with a long range gun if you want or a sniper. This is a really, really fun gun. Once again, drop a like and subscribe. I put a lot of hours into these videos to make them entertaining. And of course, above everything that Todd bomb my videos, shout out to the Node game from the comment section below. You guys are the best viewers ever for enjoying the Warzone content I put on this channel. You guys have really been pushing me to go crazy on the second channel, and we've done so so well, bro. We're so close to 20,000 subscribers on here. And even though I've got 200 and like, what, 15K on the other channel, seeing this channel grow is like amazing. It's like seeing life happen. You guys are the best. Enjoy this Warzone content. And uh, we'll have some more videos tomorrow. I'll see you guys later. Okay, so here we are playing some Call of Duty Warzone solo versus quads, and uh, we'll hopefully make some fun of Scry here. We're using the uh, BP50 conversion because it legit it's faster than almost every other SMG in this game, and uh, make some, some opponents really mad here, hopefully, anyways. An MTZ and a Striker 9. Should we be able to get our full loadout from this Platinum card as well? His teammate's not here. He's mad. Don't blame me, man. I'd be mad too. Can't lie. Okay. Nerf this! Where are they hiding at? Are y'all below me? Oh, what is that? Oh, this could be very useful. Actually, I'm trying to play some fools out here. I really did not deserve that kill, Haiki. I don't care. Find me, bitch. Yeah, squad on your attack map. Go get hunting. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Use your attack map to hunt down the rest of them. Really just playing with my food now. Using a 2 SMG meta is very hard because. Enemy isn't there kind of impressed at least? I'm gonna leave him be actually. Kind of wanted them to keep responding here. Let me go ahead and go towards control though. Actually, even people might be going for their loady here. being on a burner and then there's being uh on a super burner we really is not dying here huh yeah they're gonna want to get inside very quickly here Couldn't hit him. They're all above me. Uh, 
That was kind of crazy. They're right below me, slash behind me. Holy crap, they're fighting like animals up in this lobby. Oh, what are we doing, guys? It's PP50. Sometimes they gotta say screw it to the uh, to the objective. Okay, this dude's up here somewhere. They're both up there. Below me. Okay, his teammates over here on the same floor. Enemy soldier incoming. Target down. Marking the rest of them. He landed below here. Guess Mr. Who is AFK? Marking the rest of that squad on your attack map. Get hunting. I really got rid of a whole team like that. That's actually kind of crazy. What did I just do here at control? <laughs> like, it's down to 10. Win this, thing. this gun, this gun is just on another level. I really couldn't believe just what I did there. Freaking 30 of them already is like insanely good. I think I eliminated these teams like fella quick Bounty though. Free. We have all our perks too. By Buy two UAVs. Let's hope we can win this game now. I see you. Kill confirmed. We located the rest of them. Get a UAV again. I can't believe we're actually on like a 30 gun streak right now. Kind of crazy. Oh, they're all together here. I don't like the look of this. Can we get our first 40 here? That's a question. Hold on. First, and we located the rest of them. Damn it! Just killed me. Okay, it's all good. We're not completely dead. And our Lodi is still in range. Wow. Did we get our 40 here, bro? Oh man, we're gonna go crazy, crazy with it. Oh, that's a scanner. I didn't realize that was a scanner. Actually, let me see. Anybody use the scanner yet? Getting the the scanner spots pretty. Well. Okay, this one's already been used. As you can see there, the AMR9, it's just way better at that range. He had the advantage there. I should have flanked around. It's all good though. We did as well as we could. Solo versus quads. I'll take a freaking, what, 34 kill gameplay? He went the heck in, man. Make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're new, turn on the post notifications for more Warzone. Hear more hero. 36 freaking kills with the VP ability. Try it out for yourselves. This is my highest score so, lot, so far on Rebirth. This could have been a 40. I'll get better, guys. Thank you for enjoying. I